Santa 64. How much? Oh my god. Josh. Okay. What is going on, you guys? My name is Josh, also known as Harry Tornado, here this morning with my beautiful wife, Haley. We are on the way to some garage sales. I think, based on what we're seeing on Craigslist and Facebook and the signs that we're seeing along the road, this should be a very good day for garage sales. So stick around. Here we go. Two signs. Oh, this, is, this is what Saturday mornings are all about, baby. How are y'all? Good, how are you? Good. Yeah, because I need to clean it up. All the DVDs. Lots and lots and lots of DVDs. All the box sets are three dollars. All the movies are a dollar. Okay, so I have six box sets so far. Okay. The video games. I don't here. know what you wanted, but I did see these. Oh yeah. Rock bands, and there's two rock bands. Or there's a guitar here, Metallica. Here, I'm sorry. Oh, okay. I'm going to buy the rubber bands. Guitar here. I was going to rubber band some of these boxes. Yeah, boxes. we'll get all those. How much are your video games? Oh, a dollar. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All those are a dollar. Six. Yeah, we'll get all the rock bands. Do you have any uh, controllers, like rock band guitars? No. No. Well, that doesn't work. Yeah. That's yeah. why we, yeah. we, 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 those are broken. These are pretty hard on them. Yeah. <laughs> the rock, drums. rock too hard. The drums were too hard. Yeah, my daughter was. Get trash. She would be playing the drums at like midnight. Like. We got to break these. So. <laughs> stop, stop with the drums at midnight. <laughs> I think, I think that's it. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22 video games and six box sets. So that's How many 18 plus 22, 40 bucks. 22 video games and six, six yeah. bucks. So 40 bucks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. There you go. Thanks, sir. Perfect. Thank y'all. Thank you. Y'all have any more video games, do you? Um, You're not putting out. No, that's all the video games that we've got right now. <laughs> that was a very good selection. I just, I couldn't leave without asking. Sure. <laughs> right. Appreciate y'all. Secret stash in the back. You yeah. Know, the, the one you're I'm bringing them out later yeah. for the second crowd. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> y'all have a good one. All right. Moving. Next sale. Looks, looks decent. I think we might have some good stuff here. Good morning. Some sort of video games. How much one of your whole box of video game stuff? What's that? How much one of the whole box? Did you open it up? Yeah. Get 20 bucks for all of it? I can do that. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. And there's an Xbox in there. Yeah, yeah, we opened up. Awesome. It's awesome. The golf clubs aren't for sale, right? Those. No. I, did, I didn't <laughs> think so. Yeah. So I just have to film like 
our emotions right now because that box I, I still haven't even looked in it all I saw was the Xbox the N64 and then I lifted the Xbox and saw that there was like 20 25 N64 games on there uh, in the box the only one that I saw was like Mario Party I'm pretty sure that's like a $30 game as it is I don't know but I was like I'm just gonna buy all of it and uh, I mean you guys saw what happened 20 bucks for that whole box absolutely like I, I almost feel bad, like $20 for all that stuff. I mean, just the just the N64 alone uh, with one gray controller is gonna sell for like 80 to 100, I think. Um, so we have the purple controller, all the games, and the Xbox. I mean, definitely just a crazy, so crazy. Much adrenaline. I know, I was <laughs> like, Ailey, this, this is like why we wake up at the crack of dawn to go to garage sales. Oh, look. <laughs> How's it going? How's it going? Get out of my hood. I was like, we're definitely going to run into Kim and Philip today for sure. We have a trunk load of video games. We got the. Okay, oh my gosh. We found a whole box of in 64 games. Like, on this, on this? No, it was in another sale. Hey, good morning. I used to have one of these. What is it? It's yeah, it's a little it's a bank, like you would put a quarter on it and it would eat it. <laughs> what do you want on the wetsuit? Uh five dollars. It's pretty cool. You think it'll fit me? <laughs> Looks like it. <laughs> Haley, do you think this will fit me? I like it. I'll give you five bucks for it. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, Morning. Nah. Ooh, I needed some of these for that that tape cassette thing I got last week. I was literally. Like, I knew somebody would want those. I said, uh, we went to, 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 to some uh, garage sales last week, and I found this like vintage tape. Uh, like oh. four track recorder uh -huh. yeah. but of course i don't have any blank tapes well, so that's I was, perfect I was away one day. I said, no, let me wait and see. Right. there's somebody out there that still probably wish i had them later but whatever yeah. shoot i've got one still in a wrapper but i don't know where it is and like, hmm. yeah, a lot of people have them just stored away you know yeah. 15 bucks Hmm. Normally these tapes wouldn't really be valuable at all, but because I can pair them with that tape deck cassette thing recorder I got last week, these are actually super valuable to me. So I was going to pay her a dollar for all three of them, but she wouldn't take it. Super nice lady. Hello. Are you hearing? I am. Yeah. <laughs> I have always I have dreamed of this moment. I Look at there. I cannot believe it. Hey, you're, you don't have to go in, do you? Yeah, I do. I do. Uh, do do you mind being in the video? Because <laughs> that, that was a very good reaction. I'm not kidding. You don't understand. This is big. I, I, I will die. And Haley, of course. Haley. Yeah. You just got back from um, Utah. Utah. Yep. Wow. And, and because of that, I'm now watching your friend. Your Ashley, friend. Ashley. Ashley and Tim. I haven't seen Tim's yet. But Tim's Ashley's, good. My husband's even like, let's get that. Let's put Ashley back on there. Let's start watching her a little bit yeah. more. But in addition yeah anyway this is great <laughs> i'm happy to be here i've never been recognized i've been recognized at yard sales but never by the person having the sale so that's no, awesome I'm not having sale. oh you're not i'm okay. shopping i said let me get my stuff before he comes out okay here. okay <laughs> I said, oh, no. and i think about you when i go to pick something up i'm like do you want a bag for that i'm throwing it oh, this is great i can't wait to call my husband and <laughs> <laughs> well it's good to meet you what was your name phyllis phyllis okay mm -hmm. awesome phyllis. Yes, and that's it. So where y'all heading today? This is probably like the seventh or eighth sale we've been to. Yeah. So oh we've we've had some pretty good luck so out far. In this neighborhood. This neighborhood, there's a lot of sales. We haven't really found much here. That's because I've got it all. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we, we, sh we should have beat you here. I like the Forerunner. Thank you. It's a little cooler looking than mine. <laughs> See, I gotta get tires like yeah, that. You need tires like <laughs> I almost talked. Yeah, I answer to Harry now. <laughs> have a good one. All right, so we're at a church 
rummage sale right now. I don't see any signs. I was kind of nervous. Some lady, the, the lady at the last uh, yard sale, Miss Phyllis, told us about this place. And we figured we'd come and try it out. Sold. That kayak sold for 15 bucks. Really? It's probably like a $200 kayak. There's a lot of people. What is it? It's a peanut. Oh, it's like a little. Yeah, that's cool. How much is it? Two yeah. bucks? Yeah, I'll get that. All right, so far I picked up this Canon camera lens, 35 to 80 millimeter, probably personal use, um, but it's probably worth like, I don't know, maybe 30 bucks or so. Uh, and then this peanuts thing, I don't know what it's worth, but it's that one. Um, this was two bucks. Those are pretty cool. Yeah. Can we pay you? Oh yeah. Okay. Nobody helping you. I've already paid for these things inside. Oh. We found those over there in a box. How much were those shoes? Do you know how much the shoes were? I think we got two bucks. Two bucks. Okay. okay. I'm trying to. Don't trust my memory. Yeah, it does. That one old thing. Yeah. 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 What'd you get there? Let me see that. This one? Yeah. That's a little, that was uh, neat. Yeah. It's that one. Yeah. And then sweet. Painting, painting Woodstock. Yeah. Two bucks. That's awesome. Yeah. Her mom really yeah. likes Snoopy and Woodstock. Yeah, that's awesome. So. Yeah. You got the camera lens. Did you see the. I've got a couple tripods. Anytime I find a camera lens, I'll, I have to buy it. I can't yeah. turn them down. There were two of them in there. That, that I just saw this one. Somebody might have bought the other one. I don't know. Hurt your feet. All my shoes hurt. I don't care what kind of. One pair of shoes. Thank you. Bike shoes. I saw those. Yeah, they're cycling shoes. That's what I thought they were. Thank you. They don't. Thank you so much. Got a couple things at that last sale. The sale right before that, that one neighborhood sale we went to, was basically a bust. All I got was that wetsuit. But I still haven't looked in this box of N64 games. I'm super excited to do that probably after we get home. There's one more neighborhood sale we're going to, so let's head there now. See a golf club over there? Getting good. Thank you, Prices are extremely negotiable on all the clubs, putters, whatever you see. What are you asking? Just going with, uh, I didn't see uh, the price but individually, some of them. I mean, I can just make a pile of all the ones yeah, I'm interested please. in. Yeah, I'd, I'd give you. Listen, you'll get a you'll get a bundle price that you'll you'll appreciate. So, okay. So I've got mostly like rescue clubs, and in here mm -hmm. there are a couple sets. There are like a, that title. They got two title siren sets. Okay. Um, and then of course, if you need a driver, look down there. And it's, it's <laughs> yeah. Okay. Awesome. There's a Nike. I used to have this one in high school. Really? Yep. Yeah, those are pretty good. There's, there's another one here. I think there's three all together. Grab all three of those. Y'all play much? I play uh, five days a week. <laughs> walk nine, walk nine where, holes every morning. Where, um, maybe, where, where do you play? Where, Oak Hills, usually. Yeah. That front nine's really easy, so okay. I like playing out there. Wow, I like that. I'm actually very envious. That's that's. Yeah, we uh, wake up early. Our tea time is usually like 6.45, so we're done. Wow. I play with my preacher, so we're done walking nine holes, but I'm home by 8.30, you know? Wow. So you got your steps in. It, it's beautiful that early in the morning. Right. I mean, you haven't had a chance to make any bad thoughts. That's right. With the man of the Lord, how much better does it get? It, it doesn't get any better than that. Yeah. Okay, so we got these these here and the three older Callaways. So what do you think? Double Again, it's going to be a deal in the house if there's anything else that's not that Um, let's, let's, let's um, yeah, do y'all do anything with rescue clubs? Or like the, um, I got a few of them. I got the, the Cleveland Masher and the yeah, okay, gotcha. Adams. I, I just, I've never. I like them. Yeah. 
Yeah, I think that's it. All right. That's a cool hat. Now, so listen, I, I take the hat. Throw the hat in there. How about that? <laughs> yeah, I think if you drop some. some oh. Oh yeah, where's that? Where's that even go? Wherever you want it to. Baby. Right there on the side. <laughs> I, I, I had to reach for that one on the other. It's still early. I don't, I don't, I don't think I'd have a use for it, honestly. Yeah, yeah please, please, <laughs> please take it. Take, take All right, you give me a good deal in the clubs. I'll, I'll yeah. take the hat. Okay. Right. There you go. So what I was gonna say with this, so with the bag, I was gonna go forty for all that. Yeah. And the okay. bag. Yeah, and the hat. Yes, sir. I'll do forty for all that. That's a cool. good deal. Yeah, I told you it would be a. Oh, she's the lady oh, with the money. Yeah. Okay. I keep forgetting that. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Have some good hits with him. Enjoy. Them. I'll I'll try my best. No Thank promises. You. Enjoy talking to y'all. Yeah. Oops, plumage. <laughs> That's the word of the day, right? Yes. I'm gonna try to use that as. I'm I don't think I've ever used that word before. I'll never see it again in the last of my life. <laughs> Honey, I got the hat. Plumage. <laughs> Took the plumage. Threw it in. Drop the freaking plumage again. Okay. Hey man, you're supposed to stay on your side of town. Hey man, you're supposed to stay on your side of town. <laughs> What's good? What, uh, dude, I, I gotta show you this. Look at this. The you first... just killed the ball good golf clubs. I know. Like, they, they it wasn't, scared. I mean, we, we got a couple of them, but this, this was the score, man. No, you didn't. It was, the Nintendo stuff was sitting on top and the box was taped shut, so I just like opened it. Oh, come on, man. I opened it and saw that. It better not be. And I was like, how much you want for the whole box? He said 20 bucks. Are you serious? I haven't even looked at all the games yet. I was just, I just like scooped it. I scooped it and ran. Dude, what else is under that box? the whole box for 20 bucks. 20 bucks. It's got an N64 console in there. I think three controllers, <laughs> like 20 games. You couldn't whip out that 20 fast enough. I couldn't. I was like, all right, let's hurt and get out of here. shaking. <laughs> yeah. All right, we just got home. Went to one Goodwill after that last set of yard sales. Found the couple things where did i put my oh it's right here i found this uh camera nikon camera for 194 it's like a little point and shoot should sell for about 40 bucks and i found a pair of vibram five finger women's running shoes uh these were 650 and they should sell for maybe like 30 35 or so uh but the big thing i want to look at is all of these video games video games and dvd sets in here and then this box we have no idea what's inside yet all right, so I just went through this first bag that we got at that first garage sale, and there were a couple good ones. Like, all the rock bands are definitely going to be worth money. I usually either, I mean, you can sell them as is. Like, this Beatles one sells as is for, like, $12 to $15. This uh, Metallica one one should sell for, like, $15 to 20 bucks or so. So those are really good. The other ones, I mean, you have rock band one, two, and three. So if I ever get another rock band drum set uh, with a guitar, I could pair it with these three games, and that would increase the value of that bundle significantly. Um, this... Uh, street home court game is pretty good i think that's like 15 bucks all these were like the better games and then these are the not so great games but i didn't want to like I mean, we were the first ones at that yard sale i didn't want to sit there and like search everything on ebay right in front of them so i just grabbed the ones that i didn't recognize um and hoped that some of them would be valuable so these i mean we definitely make money we, we spent uh 40 bucks all together on all this stuff um just as superman complete uh set should sell for about 25 bucks um the the flash i haven't even looked that one up yet oceans oceans uh, 11 12 and 13 another guitar hero basically on this haul i spent 40 dollars and i should see a profit after fees and expenses of around 120 to 150 dollars so all in all definitely made some good money there but now we get into the serious money this should sell for maybe 15 bucks or so it's all two nintendo 64 controllers original like nintendo with uh whatever that is rumble pack or something i don't even know uh, but then I op open the box, just the, the controller should sell for like 20, this one maybe like 20, this one maybe a little bit more since it's like the teal one, um, and they both have those packs in there. So definitely see good money. And I open it up and instantly just saw like the edge of the N64 games. I lifted, lifted up, saw all those, and I saw the N64 over here, um, then just bought the whole box. We got a, Mario Party right there. yeah, there's Mario Party right on the top. So this is an older um, white Xbox, um, probably not worth a ton. I mean, I've, I've got a bunch of Xbox stuff in that box over there, so I could put a bundle together, maybe sell it locally, but I want to see I want to see what games are in here. So we got Top Gear, Super Mario 64, Top Gear Hyperbike. All the Mario ones are going to be good. Mario 64, Mario Party. Do you want me to hold the GoPro? Uh, yeah, that'd be good. 
We got Mario Golf, my favorite N64 game of all time. We got Mega Man 64. I think that one's pretty good. Superman. It just has a picture of Superman on the top there. We got Banjo, Banjo Tooie. We got Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2. That's a good one. Turok 2. I don't know what these are worth, but I know that's a good game. Um, this one that fell here is Hot Wheels Turbo Racing. Star Wars Episode 1 Racer. Glover. I played that one before. Uh, Super Smash Bros. That's a good one. We got Pokemon Snap. That's good. Uh, RE Volt. Never heard of that one. Star Fox 64. This was the very first game I ever got on Nintendo 64. Man, that brings back some memories right there. I actually remember getting this like from my mom's boyfriend for Christmas, but I hadn't gotten my Nintendo 64 yet. So I'm like, man, what if what if Santa doesn't bring me an N64? <laughs> but he did. Santa pulled through. Batman Beyond, The Return of Joker. That's pretty cool. Star Wars Rogue Squadron. Mario Party 2, that's a good one. And oops, and Extreme G. I don't know about that one. So these are definitely some good games. Uh, man, there's some more stuff on here. Looks like something's been eating this one. Music Maker Deluxe Edition. Okay. Grand Theft Auto Vice City for PS2. Oh, some more controllers. Jeez, I don't Louise. know if I'm holding this right. Yeah, that's one. <laughs> Something's been in here eating this stuff. Ooh. This is like a box that's been like in the attic. Crazy Taxi, PS2. Need for Speed, Hot Pursuit, not in there. PS2, Gun Griffin Blaze. Oh, it's not in there though. That looks like a cool game. Quidditch World Cup, PS2, it's in there. Oh, some more Pokemon Stadium N64 and Mario Tennis for N64. Okay, we paid 20 bucks for this whole box. Arrow Fighters Assault. Okay, so there's the cords. Oh, an alarm clock. Perfect. I really think they've had this in their attic for years. Little uh, Nintendo 64 transfer pack. That's how you can put Game Boy games in there and then play Game Boy games on the N64, mm. I think. Two more controllers, green Nintendo OEM, and another gray one, a wired Xbox controller, and then the N64. A couple more things, don't you? That's uh, Splinter Cell, Tom Clancy's. And that's it. Paid 20 bucks for all that stuff. That's just... That's crazy. Here are all those golf clubs I picked up at that one sale along with the bag and that hat that I left in the car because I do not want that hat. But we paid 40 bucks for all of these. Uh, just to give you guys a rough idea, this Cleveland Mashie 18 degree should sell for about $40 plus shipping as it is. So there's going to be most of our money back. This Alien Wedge was really popular back in the day and it still should sell for uh, probably like 20 bucks plus shipping. This a Cushnet. Uh, vintage putter Kushna is the company um, made in USA. It's definitely vintage um, same company that owns like Titleist. So this should sell for I don't know maybe 25 30 bucks um, a three we had three Callaway Warbirds a three wood a five wood and a driver um, If you you could probably sell all three of them together for maybe like 50 or 60 dollars plus shipping um, or individually list them for 20 to 25 plus shipping um, I'll probably sell them all together just because I have you know, hundreds of golf clubs as it is this Walter Hagen is pretty nice SP7 10 and a half degree driver It's got a little dent right there if you can see that so it definitely hurts the value a little bit But it shall, still should sell for about $20 plus shipping and then this nice uh, Vintage not vintage just old Nike Sasquatch nine and a half degree driver um, It's in pretty good condition that should sell for about $50 plus plus shipping um, I didn't look up the soul comps on this Adams idea I would yet, but I imagine that's probably a 30 or $40 club as well. Uh, and then the bag, nothing special about the bag, just like a night. Uh, I think it's a night, yeah, night branded, um, maybe 20 bucks on Facebook Marketplace. So that was a not a great golf club haul, like nothing fantastic, but 40 bucks into maybe, 
I don't know, 120 $120 in profit. I have no idea what I was thinking here. I just told you guys the soul comps on this. I'm going to make way more than 120 on these golf clubs. I'd say it's probably more like 225 to 250 after all fees, shipping, and cost of goods are accounted for. Also picked up this pair of Nikes at that church sale. Haley just cleaned these for me. Uh, they're in good condition, except this little strap over here has some rips in it. I didn't see that when I picked them up. We only paid two bucks for them, um, but they, they should sell pretty well. I mean, they're in really good condition other than that. Um, I looked up the model number, 312047001, but I couldn't really find a lot of information, but it does say Nike Shocks. Um, somewhere oh, on the toe, Nike shocks on the toe. Um, normally Nike shocks that have like the little things in the back are gonna sell between like 50 and $70. And I've never seen a pair like this. So I'm gonna say these are gonna be, even even with the cut on the, the, the couple cuts right there, I still think they're gonna be a 50 to $75 shoe plus shipping, pretty sure. Uh, and these are those Vibram five finger shoes we got a goodwill these should sell for again like maybe 30 bucks or so so before i end today's video i want to give you guys a little synopsis of today's haul because it was absolutely in freaking sane we spent a total of about four hours at all the garage sales the church sale and that one goodwill we went to and i spent a total of 120 dollars on all the stuff we bought to flip Looking at all the sold comps on the things we picked up today, I think it's safe to say that once everything is cleaned, processed, listed, and sold, we should see a total net profit after all fees and expenses of about $1,100 on all the video games, the golf clubs, the shoes, everything we picked up today. And I think it's going to take probably another four hours of work to get everything listed and shipped out. So we're going to be all in for today's haul for about eight hours of work. That's sourcing, listing, shipping, everything. Eight hours of work for $1,100 in profit, which means our hourly income for today's work is gonna be about $137.50 an hour. Of course, it goes without saying, but I'm gonna go ahead and say it anyway. Not all garage sale Saturdays are this fruitful. There have been many Saturdays that Haley and I will go out to 5, 10, 15 sales and buy absolutely nothing. So today was truly special. I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video as much as we enjoyed living it. I don't want to call this a once in a lifetime garage sale haul because there are deals like that still out there ready to be found, but it is incredibly rare to find deals like this out in the wild in 2021. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, take a couple seconds and hit that like button down below. And if you haven't yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button down below as well. Thank you guys again for watching. You're the best and I'll catch you on the next one.